Chantilly and this is my YouTube channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're not new here, welcome back to a new vlog. I've been very consistent with the vlogging, more so than the sit down videos. And that's just because I enjoy vlogging more. I enjoy the process of vlogging more. So, I don't know. That's just what's gonna be on my channel mostly for now. Just for now. I'm gonna start a in, in October, I'm going to actually do Spooktober. Be on the lookout for that. It's going to be all, you know, like my haunted stories, my haunted experiences. It's going to be a lot of like true crime coverage. There's going to be also like urban legend coverage. So it's just going to be spooky stuff and I'm excited for that in October. And in September, since Happy New Month, by the way, in September, which is my birthday month, what? In my birthday month. Um, anyways, it's just so late. Like I am turning 24 on September 21st. Um, I'm not doing anything big. What can I do? I don't. Even, I don't have friends. I don't. Mm, I don't like the. Mm. We're probably just gonna go like camping or something, or just you know, I'm gonna spoil myself. I deserve it. Hi. So we are going to cook today. Okay. Right now I just want to meal prep some potatoes that I'm not going to eat because of keto. But anyways, I'm going to meal prep some potatoes that I'm going to grill. Um, I'm going to make some red potatoes and red onion together. You guys, <laughs> we got our dining table. Wait, let me just show you properly. But yes, finally we got it. There's a chair missing, however. Let me get it. Like I'm trying to show you the color scheme of this. Like, so that's the color of the wood of the table and that's the color of the chair. And then that's the color of the top of the table, which is beautiful. Altogether, it's nine feet long. It fits 10 people. So on this side, we're gonna have four chairs. On that side, we're gonna have a long bench, which is not here yet. And when they were delivering, unfortunately, one of those chairs broke. Not, that was not our fault, that was their fault. So they took it with them, but otherwise it should have been six chairs, but it's coming together. Look at that, I can't wait for Christmas parties. Oh my God. Like the holiday season is just right timing for this beautiful girl. And I'm gonna put um, some nice center pieces. There's gonna be a lot of like tablescaping. So stay tuned for that, especially for Thanksgiving. Probably gonna have a beautiful table runner and some pumpkins and some roses and mason jars. You'll see how it looks. Yeah, so that's my table. The triangular curve detail right there, which this was not on purpose. But look, look at the chair too, with the triangular curve on the side too. Like we did not do that on purpose. I really didn't do it on purpose, but it worked out great. I just picked it out um, just because of the color and how nice it would go with my floors, which we redid. You guys haven't, have you, well, you've been seeing the floors in my vlogs. But if you wanna see a nice before and after of this floor, you can go and watch my house tour, my empty house tour. Um, I'm still waiting for sofas and like, you know, like my actual living room situation to arrive. <sighs> COVID has made the furniture process so, so long. And then there's specific chairs that I'm waiting for from Target. These two chairs, they're, they're gonna be accent chairs. They've been out of stock for months months and I keep calling them and they're like, oh, are you on the list? And I'm like, yes, I'm on the list. I'll show you the chairs. This chair right here, like this, I am waiting for this so much. Like I've been lit like every single day going online to check if this chair is available and it's not. I want it in this specific color so that it can match my actual sofas. So I'm gonna have two of these ones. <sighs> My God, I just can't wait for it to be in stock. And the thing for me is that I'd rather wait and get exactly what I want than rush my house. Like, I don't wanna rush. There's no need. Honestly, if you have a new house, there's no need to rush through the process of like completing it. Mm -mm. People say that their house, is, their house is never complete. Like a house is never fully complete, which is true. Like you're always gonna be making some changes and tweaks. You're always gonna be buying some new stuff as your style evolves, as what you like, you know, your surrounding to be evolves, which is constantly evolving. <laughs> so I know it's not gonna be complete, complete, but I'm excited about that. This shirt says, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place because I'm so excited to vlog. This shirt says, I feel, I feel like something good is going to happen. 
and my husband got it for me from Japan right before you know the COVID situation got really bad. For September, I'm thinking I really am considering starting to upload more singing videos. I need encouragement, like I just need motivation to do it and I, I, I don't know what's stopping me but be on the lookout for those as well because I'm going to start uploading more singing videos because if you don't use it, you're gonna lose it, okay? Okay, so what I'm trying to make is this. <laughs> I'm trying to make that situation happen with my uh, red potatoes and onions, but this is obviously squash and green beans. But my mother-in-law just got this for my husband, so we're gonna use that on the grill. So I have a bag of red potatoes and I also have a bag of broccoli, which I do not think I'm gonna use the broccoli person. No, I probably will. So I know this is not a kitchen towel. This is actually just a regular sized towel, but I have so many potatoes that I have to dry them with this. I hate working with wet potatoes. Okay, so now that my potatoes are done and washed and dry, I'm gonna chop them up and then set them up. I'm gonna spice them, put some garlic in them, butter, and I think pappies, I think that's the seasoning that I'm gonna use. I'm not gonna go, like, I'm not gonna be dramatic with the seasoning. When it comes to the meal prep part of it, this is what I love doing most, more so than like the actual like cooking. Let's get started with that. I'll put some garlic in there. There too, just a little bit. And with the pappies seasoning. my god onions like this does not happen often but my husband the other day was like this hurts and yes it does it hurts there's these specific ones really hurt <laughs> oh come on so we're gonna pour this on top insecure I really am insecure about this whole thing because I really have never used it before I don't know I don't know well that's fine that's fine actually let's just do this let me just send it and then if anything bad happens it happens right. time to go to the grill While we wait for the potatoes to cook, I'm going to start making the broccoli. I had initially wanted to make mushrooms, but we do have a guest that does not eat mushrooms, so I would rather just accommodate everybody. Let's get started with the broccoli. I'm going to saute it with white onion because there's already red onion in the potato, so let's at least differentiate that factor. And then I'm gonna put in some ginger, garlic, and of course spices. And I don't know if I wanna use butter or coconut oil for this. This is what I'm gonna use in there to make everything. Then I'm gonna go ahead and squirt a little bit of this ginger in there. Broccoli, I mean some garlic. Then 
the reason why I break my broccoli up so much is because I like them to be fork size, like not fork size, but bite size. I don't like food that doesn't fit in my mouth. Me personally, it's just a personal thing. Like I just prefer to be able to pick it up with my fork and put it right into my mouth and not make a ridiculous face because I'm trying to chew it. So <laughs> that's the reason as to why I have to make them like bite size. Cardamom, just a little bit of cardamom in there. Chicken masala, I know guys, I know, don't worry about it. Don't worry, it's gonna be good. It smells very Indian inspired. Speaking of which, I went to an Indian store um, yesterday and I can't tell you how many crazy looks I got from the people that work there and the people that were shopping there. dining table is clean too. It's over. This vlog is finished. I am so exhausted. I really am. So will I get demonetized for John Legend? That's John Legend. If I give you a credit, I'll, I will be. John Legend, that's his song. Um, so it's, that's it for me. I hope to see you guys in the next videos. I hope you enjoy this vlog. I hope you're enjoying my vlogs in general. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. Go ahead and do it. You know you want to. <laughs>